Hey everybody, Daniel Fusco here, and welcome to today's Two Minute Message. So, uh, I have been thinking a lot about the fruit of the Spirit. I did write about it in my book, Crazy Happy, Nine Surprising Ways to Live the Truly Beautiful Life, because there are nine characteristic fruit of the Spirit. But I've been thinking a lot about the fourth characteristic, which is long-suffering or patience. And the reason I've been thinking about it a lot is because, to be honest with you, it's not really all that patient. And one of the things that the Lord has been really encouraging me on, challenging me with, is that every day is an opportunity for me to grow as I trust Jesus in the fruit of the Spirit. And so when you think about the idea of long-suffering, I think long-suffering is such a great definition for the word patience. It literally means a steadfastness of soul when you're under provocation. And I'll be honest, no one likes to be provoked. Nobody likes to have these issues going on. But when we trust the Lord, it's really easy to, to, to be patient because we're like, Lord, you're gonna work this out. And Lord, I don't really like what's going on. I don't really like what they're doing, but I can trust that you are gonna be glorified ultimately in what's going on here. And you're gonna work out whatever the issues are. So really, patience is trust in action. And in a lot of ways, I'm constantly reminded because I find myself being so impatient sometimes that really my impatience is a sign of doubt or a lack of faith. And then I'm reminded what it says in Hebrews chapter 11, verse 6, where it says, for without faith, it's impossible to please God. For we must first believe that he is and that he is the rewarder of those who diligently seek after him. So I'm reminded and I'm actually really excited about the fact that every single day God has given me opportunities to exercise the, you know, the fruit of his spirit, which is called long suffering because I trust him. And when I'm struggling to trust him, I get impatient. So your trusting the Lord is actually tied to your patience. Powerful. Listen, this is what I do. I want to share this video because I'm pretty sure everyone is having their patience tried in some ways. And we want that perspective that it's a gift from the Lord and it's an opportunity for us to trust in him. In the comment section, I want you to share, hey, this is something that I'm waiting on the Lord and I'm trying to be patient in. And, and, and we'll use it as a, as a time almost to be able to pray together about the things that are going on in people's lives. So feel free to share, hey, this is an area where I'm impatient or I'm struggling to trust the Lord in and we're gonna see what God wants to do. And God bless you today.